Now we will discuss field recalibration of the DG25 digital pressure gauge. Field recalibration requires the operator to have a pressure standard and a reference gauge that's at least four times more accurate than the gauge being calibrated. In this case, we are using an Ashcroft digital test gauge with 0.05% accuracy. In measurement mode, press the menu key with a long key press to enter menu mode. Use the up and down keys to scroll until the word recal is displayed, then press the enter key. Use the up and down keys to scroll to new, fact, or field. Field will only appear if the gauge has previously been recalibrated. The numeric value displayed in this selection is the number of times the gauge has been field recalibrated. To restore original fact recalibration, choose fact by a short press of the enter key. To restore the last field calibration values, press the enter key when field is displayed. To perform a full field calibration, when the gauge reads new, press the enter key. Use the up and down key to scroll between confirm and cancel by a short press of the enter key. Confirm will enter the calibration sequence. The numeric display will show you the pressure to be applied to the gauge and direct the operator what to do. The first pressure is zero. The alphanumeric display will scroll through the message apply, ref, PSI, then press enter to start or other to abort. When the gauge is vented, press the enter key. The display will count down six seconds and instruct the user to apply full scale pressure in PSI. The alphanumeric display will scroll through the messages apply, ref, PSI, then press enter to start or other to abort. When full scale pressure is stabilized, press the enter key. The display will count down six seconds and instruct the user to apply 50% of full scale pressure in PSI. When reference pressure is stable, press the enter key to save the value. If the gauge is a positive pressure gauge, the display will read Cal good and go into measurement mode. If the gauge is a compound range, one additional calibration point near vacuum will also be needed to be applied. That value is negative 14.0 PSI, following the same steps performed at the three positive pressure points. Field calibration is now complete.